Um, she is Ivan's wife. Um, she is, I would say like mid thirties, um, Russian middle class, uh, speaks French. <laughs> um, she's very, um, she's not afraid to speak her mind, I would say. She's pretty assertive. Um, and she doesn't mind annoying her husband, <laughs> which is always fun to play. Um, and uh, she and Ivan have a son, Vladimir. He's um, pretty central to the family unit, I would say. Mm -hmm. I think, yes, I think Praskovia definitely has been living that um, socialite kind of life. Um, she goes to the opera, she watches plays um, she, with other families. Her social life is really where her focus is, um, apart from Vladimir. And uh, yeah, I think over the years, her marriage um, has become more of a, a duty, like an obligation. Um, and uh, in this opera, so in this telling of this story, we do get this very um, profound self-reflection from both Ivan and Praskovia about their own lives and what does it mean to be alive? You know, they both say, who am I? Is this it? And I just, I find that so profound. <laughs> It's probably the first soprano role I've done where I'm not the one that dies at the end. <laughs> um, <laughs> so that's nice. Um, <laughs> it's um, It's got a lot. Uh, she doesn't quite have an aria, but she has a lullaby, um, which is really sweet and beautiful. I'm really looking forward to the process. Um, I love being guinea pigs for a new project. It's like, I just think it's so fun to be able to experiment with different ideas, um, both uh, textually, uh, dramatically, and musically. And um, I find that, I think, the most intriguing about this project. Unceasing I think what's relevant about this show now is that it does um, promote self-reflection just like this pandemic has really you know it makes us really confront our mortality and what we prioritize the most in our lives um, and I think that's definitely a question that I want the audience to keep in mind or to ask themselves throughout or at the end it's just yeah it's it's a it's a good time to reflect on your own life <laughs> um, performances for death of ivan illich are february 19th and 21st at the orlando museum of art there will be food and drinks before and you'll get to meet the cast and creators afterwards so come, you'll have a good time. To ponder.